against AIDS. Our Carrie Berglund takes a look back at how far we've come. And as he tells us, many people believe the big battle is still ahead and say that war is against AIDS discrimination. Women in society are in denial as far as women being infected with the virus that they don't think it can happen to them. And it happened to Sharon. She found out five years ago she was HIV positive and now has her good days and her bad, taking a holistic approach to fighting the disease. At times it can be real terrifying. You know, when I don't feel well, I have to look at the possibility, you know, am I going to go down to the full stage of AIDS, you know? And I don't live in that fear very often, but when I don't feel well, it's real hard. Sharon is one of the people with AIDS beating the odds. 26% of those who test positive are doing that now. Sharon was exposed by her husband, who has since died of AIDS. Her strength these days comes from her 16-year-old daughter, Janine, who is active in AIDS education, speaking to her peers about the disease. She's real special. She's a beautiful child, and it's um, real sad to see that she has to go through this. And she's not the only child out there. Sharon is also frustrated with a society she says still discriminates against people with AIDS. We need the support of our government, we need the support of our people, and we need funding, we need health, you know, health insurance, we need things that we're being denied. You don't know, you know, it's make the most of every single day, you know, and whatever that potential is, I have to do it. And um, I thank God every single day for this day of life.